George Mac McAllister is a novice beekeeper and loves keeping up his small family farm. It almost all came to a screeching halt. It was just a struggle to do things, even the simplest things. Five years ago, Max suffered two massive heart attacks, and doctors told him he had congestive heart failure. He would need a transplant to survive. In December, Mac became the first person in the United States to use a new ventricular assistant device, or VAD, called the EvaHeart. It is a continuous flow VAD, which means that blood constantly enters the pump and is continuously pushed out into the circulation. The EvaHeart releases a special fluid that flushes the pump and keeps the blood from clotting, protecting patients from one potential VAD side effect. The thing that we get worried about is these blood clots breaking off and going to the brain and causing a stroke. And that's a scary word. The EvaHeart is larger than other pumps, and despite being tethered to wires in a battery, Mac feels better than he has in years. It's just more like him. It's just, I like it. Our outlook for the future is very bright now. It's a bridge to help Mac's ailing heart while he waits for a new one. I'm Marty Salt reporting.